Hey gang, welcome back to another video. We have one more video tonight for Saturday. So I got my exclusive or member exclusive online candle haul from Bath and Body Works. So we're gonna open that up. It had two, well, one was a new candle, one was a vault candle. So let's open those up. I also got a brand new fall candle that I've never had before. So that's exciting. And then they had the 295 wallflower sale going on this weekend. So I picked up a couple of those as well. So let's go ahead and jump Jump into the online order here. Let's hope that nothing is damaged. I have not opened it up yet. So let's go ahead and get it open. Okay, so here we go. We got the four candles. We got like a little lining of bubble wrap underneath here. Just one little thin layer here. I just don't know why they can't just put like one more thin layer up top. I don't understand it. But let's go ahead and see. Okay, those seem good. Okay, I don't think we have any broken candles, so that's awesome. All right, so there's the box. Go ahead and get that out of the way. All right, let's start opening up these candles. I'm so excited. All right, so the first one that we have here, it is not broken. It is a little dusty, but not broken. Awesome. Okay, so first one we have pumpkin nut butter. Look at the packaging. I really love the packaging. It's kind of like clip arty. So we have some dots right here. It looks like maybe some peanuts or almonds of some kind right here. We got the pumpkin. So it does say limited edition new and it also says vault, but the new is colored in. And then it says Bath and Body Works exclusively fragrance soy wax blend candle. I love the black lid. Oh, very spicy. So we have the orange wax here. We have thick rope wicks. Oh, very spicy, like nutmeg, cinnamon, you know, like those fall spices. Oh, this does smell pretty good. It does smell kind of similar though. So we got pumpkin nut butter, pumpkin spice, creamy nut butter, and a sprinkle of cinnamon. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of the pumpkin spice and a lot of the cinnamon. There is some type of like creaminess or some type of subtleness of that nut butter uh, in the background. Mm, yeah, this one does smell pretty good to me. Oh, I love the little picture of the pumpkins up here as well. So pumpkin nut butter. I really love this collection. So yeah, this one smells good. It smells strong. I'm getting a lot of the spices, a lot of that cinnamon. All right, let's open up the next one here. So the next one is all oh, the other kind of repackage here. So this one's from The Vault and this one is Pumpkin Donut Shop. Love the label here, like that bronze, like goldenness against the pink. Uh, so we have little sprinkles up here. It says Vault, limited edition. We have polka dots, we got donuts. I just think this packaging is absolutely adorable. Uh, we have like little orange dots on the golden pumpkin with like a donut here with a bite taken out. Absolutely beautiful looking. We have the black lid. This one smells a little light. It's got like medium rope wicks here. We have the white wax. I really wish they did a pink wax. Yeah, this one smells really light. Okay, we got scent notes of glazed donuts, warm pumpkin spices, and sprinkled with powdered sugar. Definitely getting that kind of like glazed donut vibe. And it does have that kind of like sugariness. Oh, I'm excited to burn it though and kind of see like what it does. So no glue, no cracks, no breakage. That is absolutely amazing. So the new member exclusive candle drops. So we got pumpkin donut shop and pumpkin nut butter. I cannot wait to burn these and see what they do. All right, next up, we did get a couple duplicates of those. One to burn and one to collect. So one that is new, I've never had this before, and that is warm apple pie. I really do not like this label. It's kind of like just a square label. I really want my packaging to tell me like what is inside of the product. Whereas these, you know, you got 
the pumpkin, you got, you know, the peanuts, and you kind of, you know, you kind of know what maybe it might be. You know, this one, we got a pumpkin, we got a donut, so... It, I just want the packaging to tell me what it's going to be. And this just does not scream warm apple pie at all. But we have the uh, kind of like a, what is this? Like a, a creamy white-ish kind of lid here. Kind of like a matte finish. We have the core rope, or not the rope wicks, the core uh, thin wicks here. This one smells good. It does smell light. Okay, so this one has scent notes of baked Granny Smith apple, melted brown sugar, and flaky homemade crust. I could definitely pick up on that flaky homemade crust. Hmm, this one's interesting. It's not like as bakery, like gourmand as I thought it might be. I don't know though, I'm excited to burn it though and kind of see, you know, what it does. So this is part of the White Barn Collection. Um, these all three retail for $26.95. All right, let's go ahead and open up the other three here. All right, so we got another pumpkin donut shop. This one's going straight into the vault for the collection. And then the other one, we did pick up another of the pumpkin nut butter. Yeah, just a very spicy fall candle. Oh, this one smells a little better. Definitely get more of that like donut baked bakery goodness. Let's see if they're different batch numbers. They are different batch numbers. Oh yeah, these smell so different. So 4176AG01, that batch number Definitely smells the best in my opinion. Let me see if I can get this to focus. Probably not, but it is 4176AG01. Mmm, that one smells really good. Now the other one is 4176AG02. Yeah, I don't know. I think this one just smells just a little bit better. Okay, so I'm excited for those. All right, last one here. I don't remember. This one might just be another pumpkin nut butter, maybe. Let's see. It is, oh, another pumpkin donut shop. I really thought I was going to like this one. Let's see what this batch number is. Oh, yes, this is the number one. Yeah, this one just smells so much better. Yeah, I might actually just return this one, maybe. The Pumpkin Donut Shop, it just smells way lighter, way off. It doesn't smell as bakery goodness like these two do. Yeah, okay, so if you're getting batch number 02 at the end, uh, it might not be as good as batch number 01. Oh, so good. Okay, I might return the other one. I'm not sure yet, though. All right, next up... We have a little boppus order, so they had $2.95 Wallflower refills, and we picked up Hometown Festival. So this one is from the Sweets and Treats collection, and it has fragrance notes. It has like a little story. It says, gather together to celebrate fall with your favorite festival treats like caramel apple and fresh kettle corn. Are you kidding me? I really hope this one smells really good because I really want to pick up a couple more backups of this one. We rarely get like caramel apple and like kettle corn. We rarely ever get a kettle corn fragrance. I think we've only gotten like maybe three or four popcorn fragrances since I've started shopping in 2021. Oh, this is good. Very sweet buttery definitely getting that caramel oh yeah okay i'm gonna plug this in right away and hopefully when i get home tonight i'm really hoping that it's like really throwing here in my bedroom uh, i was gifted the espresso martini it was like a test fragrance that one is so good i don't know why they don't release that one worldwide but yeah the espresso martini amazing so hometown festival i'm gonna plug this one in and hopefully when i get home from work tonight it will go for about 
six hours so hopefully when i get home it'll smell really really good so yeah that is my 1295 member exclusive candle haul so we got pumpkin donut shop pumpkin nut butter and warm apple pie so excited for these new fall fragrances to me i've always 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 wanted to uh pick up pumpkin donut shop they had it in like this pink packaging a while back so i'm glad that they kept the pinkness and i just was so happy to see that it came back so yeah absolutely amazing who picked up the member exclusive candles i know they've been getting mixed reviews but i have to say this pumpkin donut shop Mm, it smells so good and I can't wait to see what uh, pumpkin nut butter I can't wait to see what that one does this looks so weird can you tell where like the label is down here but then it ends up here is that like a crooked label maybe let's see but it kind of looks like straight up top that is so weird it look it maybe looks like the candle is like almost defaulted on the bottom here that is awkward. Oh, it smells good though. So I can't wait to start burning these and maybe getting a review up. Hopefully if my allergies will let me. So thank you guys again so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a great Saturday night and let me know which ones that you picked up from the member exclusive. I love these drops. We've gotten in the past. We've gotten pumpkin spice latte and twisted peppermint and radiant red maple. Oh, both smell so amazing. Let's see, we've also gotten the Root Beer Float and the Pink Gumball. Pink Gumball was a really good disappointment, or a really good, a really bad disappointment. I wanted it to be good. But yeah, it wasn't super strong. The Root Beer Float was pretty good though. It literally smells like root beer. And then we've also had some other drops like Chocolate Espresso Martini. I so wish, I don't know why I didn't pick up like four of these because I don't even want to burn this one because it's the only one that I have. But man, it is good. Chocolate espresso martini. I wonder if that's the one, like the espresso martini wallflower plug-in. Ooh, I wonder if those are the same scents. This smells so good though. Chocolate liqueur, espresso, splash of vodka, doclet, doclet. Oh my gosh, dark chocolate swirl so good we've also had okay hopefully you guys are sticking around we're just going through some fun uh september candle drops we've had before we got salted caramel pretzel and candied maple bacon so wish i'd picked up more of the salted caramel pretzel smells so good a freshly baked soft pretzel brown butter caramel and sea salt mm, absolutely amazing Let's see this one right here. Now this one was a huge, like everyone was like, ew, gross. But I've actually burned this candle. It's not a bad candle. And that is Thanksgiving celebration. So this one has really weird scent notes. We got mashed potatoes, side of gravy and sage stuffing. Man, I have to say it does smell really, really good when it is burning. You get a lot of that sage. Yeah, it's honestly a really good fall candle. And then we've also had like the ice cream drop, which was absolutely amazing. We might as well get them out. I love this collection. So we got mint chocolate chip milkshake, lemon cello, and unicorn sprinkles. Mmm, so good. I love a good mint chocolate candle. We also got PB&J ice cream. This one was a lot of fun. Mm, smells so good. I loved this wraparound like sprinkled packaging. And then last one, we got the rose water and ivy and vanilla bean with the pink wraparound sprinkle packaging. Ugh, they all just smell so good. I love the September candle drops. Hopefully we continue to get more in the future. So thank you so much for watching, gang. I hope you guys have a great Saturday night and thanks for hanging out with me and I will see you in the next one. I love you guys so much.